everybody, I'm Jake from Basic Video and I'm here to show you how to add charts to your Google Spreadsheets. So follow along. Okay, the first thing that you want to do is after you have Google Spreadsheets open, click the blue button, go to Google Sheets. After, you, after you're there, you'll be brought to maybe you have some test practice sheets, maybe you have some old stuff that shows you what you've done today, that's the past seven days. Click blank. <clears throat> now that we have an open spreadsheet, go ahead and give it a name. We'll call this test chart because we're making charts in this one. After you do that, the first thing you're going to want to do is you need to add a table. So in order to insert a chart, you have to have some predefined data or information. So <coughs> let's say we have favorite pizza. This is what our chart is. And people's favorite pizza, let's say we have cheese, pepperoni, sausage, Hawaiian. Whoops, I spelled that wrong and veggie and then let's say we took the survey and actually i forgot to add i'm going to add so i can click this button to add a new row <coughs> let's do types of pizza i'm giving these titles and number of people so how many people like cheese? Let's say you surveyed 100 people. Let's say 35 of those people like cheese, 10 like sausage, 10 like pepperoni, <coughs> uh, 20 like Hawaiian. And I'm going to go ahead and equal sum to see how many left I need. So I need 25. Then 25 like veggie. So let's say out of the total of 100 people, that's our numbers. We can go ahead, we can add like a basic border to this if we wanted to, or all borders. We can make it a little longer by clicking this arrow button. After we have our tables in, now we need to insert a chart. Click the insert button, chart. Faster way to do it though, is right here there's an insert button, so click that. <clears throat> now you can see, it already brings up recommendations. You can go over here to chart types, and <laughs> try out a different one if you want. There's a whole bunch of different options here. I personally like the 3D one. But um, it isn't allowing me to do it. So what I need to do is I need to select the information. So I'm going to go ahead and select all of this. Don't select the total. It'll throw out the numbers. And now that we have this, we'll go to chart types. Scroll down here. There's a whole bunch of cool ones you could use. I'm going to do 3D. And there's my chart in Google Sheets. It has the number of people. I can go ahead and change this to favorite pizza. And now it shows me by percentage of the 100 people that, that took the survey what their favorite pizzas were. So most people like cheese, as you can see. Some like veggie. You know. Hawaiian, and so on. And that's all for how to make a chart in Google Sheets, and I hope that helps. If you have any questions, put them in the comment box below. Otherwise, I will see you guys next time.